this uh this winter has been kind of tight because last year I kind of I wasn't used to making as much money as I made last year and I just kind of took all of it and paid everything that I owed money off on and I should have kept a little bit of cash flow um, I shouldn't have bought the the snow equipment this year that's where I uh, went wrong this year is with the snow equipment because yeah. I could have gotten I could have gotten away with doing our accounts with a little salt spreader a little push spreader the few times that we did have it but um, yeah it just wasn't worth it this year to get into the snow biz but you know <laughs> now that we've got all this stuff it's all paid off and you know that's a lesson learned you don't just jump into something that you're not necessarily prepared for and we didn't really have like um, a whole bunch of guaranteed contracts we only had like two or three but like I said we could have done that with a salt spreader uh, but it, it was nice to have this piece of machinery and this setup but um, like I said I would have rather had that cash flow during these off months knowing that we don't get snow that much here but when we do it's it can be very lucrative it just didn't hit us this year we got a, a slushy storm the other night and um, yeah we, we just haven't had a good a good snowstorm this year which we usually get at least one or two every year so but anyways we're gonna focus more on the weed control and fertilization this year because that's where the money's at am I still going straight We got these signs the to put out right here, baby. Light. Left yep. at the light. Yep. I'm super pumped about the signs. Let's see how much business we can drum up from this. Um, we're going to strategically... What the fuck? We're going to strategically place them. We've got to drive to all of our customers' yards, so... Anyways, stay tuned, guys. Peace. Here's another yard that we've sprayed. We're going to put the sign right here. There are neighbors on both sides. You can see it and know who takes care of their yard for them. Mom and Dad, we're on our way to come bug you here in a little bit. We're on our way to come get on your nerves. Plus, I gotta tell Dad the agenda. I haven't spoke to him yet about it. I promise you, we're not the last to know. You were actually one of the first to know. Because I haven't told that many people. I've only told like my family. I haven't announced it yet to everybody. And I was gonna do like a small gender reveal, but I just could not contain myself. I we had neither one of us could contain ourselves. We were like, we gotta tell mom and dad, we gotta tell everybody else in the family at least. So that's okay though, because the gender reveal was only gonna be us four. Wait, five. Wait, two, six. Yeah, it was gonna be us six. But here's I told them, and that's the reveal. And then we're going to do a shower. I need help. If anybody... If Dad puts this video... Up, the, the, okay. Let's start over. If Dad puts this video out, then you guys comment and let me know what all I need on my baby registry. Do not tell me things that you think, like, they're just good to have, you know. I need stuff that's actually necessary. I don't want to waste my money on stuff that the baby's not going to use for a long time or that the baby doesn't even need, you know. So if it's necessary and it's a must, comment below so everybody can let me know what I need to put on my baby registry because that's what I'm having a hard time with because I'm a new mom. Here's the old signs. Look at the old ones versus the new. And the he tried signs. And he tried to say that you can see these other ones no, better. No, I, I didn't say you could see these ones better. I you said, said we, we should have made the, the white. said we should have made the words white. So it would have no. stuck out more. 
No, I think that whenever they're down on the ground, you can see the black better, for sure. So, we got the old girl back today. Here she is. Here she is, all, all burned up. <laughs> Looking all ugly. Looking all ugly, but you know what? She works. She works. All that matters. Still going strong. As I was saying, we're gonna be parents. Yeah. Yeah. We're having a baby. We're Bet you guys can't guess what it is. We're having a baby. We're having a baby. The daddy. Is yeah. it a boy you or a girl? Guess in the comments. What's the gender? What do you think it is? What's up, guys? It's JT here with Acme Mowing. Acme Mowing and Lawn Care. AcmeMowing.com. We picked up a new service that we uh, started offering industrial properties. <laughs> and it pays really well. Now let me take you around and show you what I done. Okay. So you know how I just told you we're doing uh, ground sterilization for industrial properties. You see this stuff right here? It's plain view SC. That is liquid gold. $800, $800 a jug. Treats four and a half acres. And it, it knocks out all of the growth. Well, I've got my backpack sprayer with me, and that's a new service that we offer, and the going rate is about 500, 600 bucks an acre, but uh, that's what I got out of this little property right here is 500 bucks. So you see all that back there? There's all growth coming in, and there's thorn bushes all back behind there, and uh, I sprayed the piss out of it so cha-ching baby can't wait to pick up some more ground sterilization clients man that's some that's some good money right there spraying uh, gravel lots for for weeds and just any any growth but anyways stay tuned guys so in about the last week we've picked up about $26,000 in annual revenue just from spraying alone. We haven't really picked up any new mowing customers yet, so we're rocking out on on last year's list and we're just going to grow in to the yards that we have. And uh yeah, we're going to we're going to try to make this year the most profitable year yet, guys. Well, here I am at this house uh spraying for a thousand bucks. Oh, I've got two of these $1000 houses today. So I'm spraying 6 acres for 1050 bucks. But he's one of our he is one of our best clients. Well, let's get it. Stay tuned, guys. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go do the backyard first. Gotta go put, put more. Uh,
fast can we get an acre done? It's been a minute and 36 seconds. One Z spray, two Z spray, three Z spray, and a whole metric poop ton of quotes. God, I feel like work's a getaway for me. I don't even look at it as work. And I think that's where a lot of people fail in what they do because they don't really love what they're doing. They're just doing it just cause. I really love what I do, so, and it shows. Shows for all the guys that work for us. They, they love what they do. 